cars drive in, the spent battery drops down, and a fully charged one replaces it automatically. This is how more and more electric vehicles are fueling up in China, by replacing dead batteries rather than recharging them. The entire process takes only a few minutes. At the time when I bought this pure electric car, there was no battery swapping station in Beijing at all. Up to now, I can change a battery for my car almost everywhere I go. As electric vehicle sales take off, the construction of swapping stations in urban areas and along highways is increasing. As of March of this year, there were more than 1,450 battery swapping stations in the country, 2.4 times more than last year. Besides private consumers, electric taxis will also have their own facilities. There is a station-to-vehicle ratio. We need to rationalize distribute our stations. For instance, there will be more than 50,000 cabs that are purely electric in Beijing by the end of this year. So the number of our battery swap stations should top 230. While battery swapping facilities grow in popularity in China, car makers in the U.S. and Europe are divided over the practice. They say for swapping stations to be successful, car manufacturers would need to agree on a standardized battery design. And for now, at least, companies like Tesla and Volkswagen aren't willing to share their trade secrets with each other.